What's up everyone and welcome. I am Reaper Digital and today I'm going to be showing you all the steps on how to enable two-factor authentication on Kik. After you sign into your Kik account, on the right hand side, top right, click your avatar icon. In the drop down menu, click on settings. Then on the left hand side, click on security. Then click on enable two-factor uh, authentication button, which is green. Now, it wants you to scan the QR code with your Authenticator app, or it says enter the code below. Either way, you have to use an Authenticator app. So if you don't have one, um, go to your mobile phone, download the Google Authenticator app from the Play Store if you're on Android, or App Store if you're on iPhone. And don't worry, the Google Authenticator app's free, so you don't have to actually buy it or spend any money on it. But once you install the Authenticator app, open it and it will ask you what email account you want to use with the app. Choose the email you use to sign up with Kik. Then if it's your first time using the Google Authenticator app, it will say, looks like there aren't any Google Authenticator codes here. Click the blue button that says add a code. After that, it'll give you two options. One is scan a QR code or the other option is enter a setup key. Click on Choose Scan a QR Code. It will ask for permissions to use your camera and record or capture video. Select only this time or while using this app to give it permissions. Now using your phone's camera, scan the QR code picture on your computer. Make sure to get the QR code image in the center of the orange square on your phone's camera. Once you do on your phone, it will pop up a code. But be sure to enter the code as fast as you can on the computer if it changes codes on you. You'll have to refresh your computer's web browser after deleting your code on your phone by holding your finger on the code and then clicking the trash can icon that pops up. Click Continue Setup on your computer once you scan the QR code with your phone and type in the code that's on your phone as fast as possible onto your computer. After that, you should be good to go. Like I said, if it says invalid code, then you need to restart this process by deleting the code that's on your Google Authenticator app on your phone and then refresh your computer's web browser after closing the QR code pop-up. So you can just click on the top left button up there, the arrow in a circle to refresh your web browser or you can close it all the way out and then restart however you want to do it. But this is how I enabled two-factor authentication on Kik. And yeah, I hope this video helps and thank you all for watching.